I promise. I promise. I promise. I promise never to use, excuse, or remain silent about men's violence against women. Violence experienced by women and girls is often rooted in the attitudes and behaviour men and boys develop over a long period of time. Some behaviours and words may seem harmless at first, but normalising them ignores the effect they have on women and can lead to more extreme violence in the future. There is always something we can do as men. As husbands and fathers, to change the story and create a better world for women and girls. That's why we support White Women Day. So when we talk about violence against women and girls, in my experience we're talking about patterns of behaviour that start somewhere but don't end. And it ranges from name calling to verbal abuse to, to physical violence. It can come out in many different ways. I think fear, um, distress, anxiety. I honestly think if the public to, were to see the kind of incidents we attend as police officers, my genuine view is that they would be horrified by what we witness and see and deal with. You see it on a regular basis. There are hundreds and hundreds of domestic incidents throughout the last 26 years. Um, generally, um, you know, really dif difficult situations where you, you can tell that the police are only getting called as a last resort. I always remember one of the, the, the most telling personal experiences for me was actually when I went into Nottingham as a, as a chief inspector to do some partner work, partnership work at one of the, the main refuges. And um, on entering the building, the first thing they did was stop me at the door and put a sign up in the building saying um, male present, which shocked me a little bit, but on reflection really hammered at home that there's some uh, women out there that are, are, are petrified. White Ribbon Day is important to me because I think it gives us as an organisation, but also every White Ribbon organisation, an opportunity to stand together against violence uh, against women and girls.